Happening now, tens of thousands of immigrants are flocking to apply for U.S. citizenship. We've discovered that it's a spike that continues to increase during this presidential cycle. WYFF News 4's Corey Davis now with the politics behind the numbers. The numbers say it all. Data from the U.S. Citizenship and Immigration Services office here in Greer show that there's a dramatic upward trend. More immigrants than in previous years want to become nationalized American citizens. The topic has been at the center of the presidential race, sparking controversy across the country. Here's Donald Trump during a rally in South Carolina. We have to be strong on immigration and we have to build a wall. We're going to build a wall. We're going to build a big, beautiful wall. A big, beautiful wall. Democrats are also in on a dispute. Comprehensive immigration reform with a path to citizenship in the first 100 days of my presidency. Secretary. As president of the United States, I will use the executive powers of that office to do what has to be done. In 2015, the national number of citizenship applications jumped more than 14 percent from the year before, according to federal records. Nearly 9 million immigrants, mostly green card holders, are eligible to become Americans. Of those, about 4 million are Hispanic. The numbers continue to go up in Georgia and the Carolinas as well. At 6 o'clock, we'll take a closer look at just how many immigrants are trying to become U.S. citizens in this busy election cycle. Corey Davis, WYFF News 4 in Greer.